It's been decades in the making and now a long sought after change is coming to Cal State San Marcos. Welcome back. I'm Carlo Chiquetto. I'm Marcella Lee. The late state Senator William Craven's name will be stripped from the campus because of racist comments he made in the 1990s. CBS 8's Abby Black reports. By the next semester, William Craven's name will be removed from the hall here at Cal State San Marcos. He's making racist statements. He may be. He's making he racist statements. No, CBS 8 archives shows people have been protesting the naming of William Craven Hall at Cal State San Marcos since the ribbon cutting in 1993. Yeah. Oh, I see. How are you? The controversy is rooted in the late state senator's move to have Hispanics carry ID cards in 1994. And then the year before that, he made racial comments during a state senate committee meeting on border issues. It, it seems rather strange that we go out of our way to take care of the rights of these individuals who are perhaps on the lower scale of, uh, of our uh, humanity for one reason or another. The idea to remove one of the founding fathers of Cal State San Marcos was rejected then, but now, 30 years later, his name is coming down from the hall and the bust will be removed. In the, the desire to move the university forward and in centering and prioritizing the needs of today's students, this made sense and was in alignment with our values. Margaret Chantung is a spokesperson for the college and says more than 50% of their student population is Hispanic. In 2021, Cal State San Marcos President Ella Neufeld formed a task force to review the removal of Craven's name and looked at the historical record. They looked at um, documents and videos and um, they opened up public uh, comments. Last week, the CSU Board of Trustees approved removing the Craven name. Students agree. And if we're holding a lot of other people accountable, then it doesn't make sense to not hold someone that did something like that accountable as well, just because they did something. But not everyone agrees. I, I have difficulty rationalizing his accomplishment with an accusation that he's a racist and a white supremacist. Ken Lounsberg is an attorney and a friend of Lake Craven and has served on the university's council for the last 40 years and submitted this brief to the CSU's Board of Trustees. And it's my view that the erasure of Senator Craven's name from the building named after him is a, is a distraction. He has built a university that has been profoundly successful uh, in promoting social mobility, particularly for Hispanic families. The school says that there will be a working group to find other ways to honor Craven's legacy. The school says there will be a working group on what to rename the hall. It will then need Cal State University trustees board of approval. In the meantime, it'll have the name of administration.